Hey, welcome. Boards has released a new feature called Form. How you use it is you go to the desktop version of Boards, log into your Boards account, go to the board that you want to use the feature in, and then you're going to hit Add. You're going to select Page. This time, forms can only be added to pages. And then over on the left-hand side, you're going to see a new icon that says form. You're going to click on it, and this is all customizable. So you can change the contact me to customer form or party form or whatever you want to label the form because that's what people are going to see, and it's going to let them know what they're filling out. From there, you can have them enter their name. You can prompt them to enter their first and last name, their social media handle, whatever you want here, you can make have them fill it out. Um, you can make it a requirement or toggle it off if you don't want it as a requirement. And that goes for everywhere where you see a blue checkbox. If you unselect it and it's grayed out, it means it's not a requirement. They don't have to fill it out. The phone number is so that you can contact them or they can contact you and you guys can exchange phone numbers. This isn't mandatory. You can even delete it out. But if you want to keep it, when someone opens the form, the flag will change to where they are. But on the off chance that you didn't want it here, you could delete it. And that goes for all these sections where you see a little trash can. You can customize it what you want in here and what you don't want in here. The message, message section is for prompts. So you can ask them, hey, I'm looking for feedback on this page. Let me know what you think. Thank you. Um, you can add multiple fields. So you can ask multiple questions or you can ask for a customized selection of feedback. So it could be like how they're liking the page, um, what they think about something that you're offering, um, any type of questions that they might have. It's space where you can allow them to respond to you, respond back to you, or ask what they want, and you can get back to them. Um, the form setting, the submit, is the label of the button that they're going to see. So if they see submit, they're going to know to click that and it's going to send you their responses. You can ch uh, change this to anything you want. It's up to you. And then the thank you message is just thanking them for taking their time to fill out your form. And at the bottom, you will see an email and the email will be the email you use for boards automatically it fills in. If that's not the email you use on a daily, make sure you change it to the email that you are checking because that is where all your responses will go. Once you're done creating your form, you hit done. You can continue building out your page um, like normal. So you can add in any of these options um, to make it a true page or just leave it as a form. When you're happy with the way it looks, don't forget to title the page and then hit done. Once you are done, you can open it and preview it and then to share it with people so they can fill out the form, make sure you hit the share button and send it to the people you want to fill out the form or post it on your social media at this current time at this recording. If it is in your boards, maybe you have a VIP suite any or a team board, they cannot fill out the form inside boards right now. So make sure you're sending it out or posting on your socials so you can get your feedback. Hope this helps.